Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Amanda. I'm a part-time reseller. And one thing I love to do is order mystery boxes. And oftentimes I'm left with a bunch of junk that I still would like to make some money on. And so today we're going to talk about one way that I am able to recoup a lot of money and something that you guys can do too. We are talking about thread up kits, the clean out kits, and more specifically their partner kits. Now, uh, one thing that kind of stinks about ThreadUp is actually right now, today's February 25th, 2022, you cannot, at least I cannot, uh, and I have always been able to order a normal clean out kit. When I go to order a kit, when I'm logged in, it says at this time, we're not accepting any clean out kits, but you're welcome to send a donation kit, which is how they get free inventory. But uh, some people might still be able to, I'm not, but that's okay because I have two kits that just now processed within the last 30 days that I sent last August, early September, end of August, early September. They just processed. So we're talking September, October, November, December, January, five months I have been waiting for these items to process. So the way around that, well, I'm going to teach you a hack. You have to stay tuned. The way around that is by ordering partner kits. And that's what a lot of you guys have asked me to explain more of. I have done one video before, but as a reseller, I love to see what the payouts look like to see if it's worth sending in items. Now for me, I do not use ThreadUp to send my higher end items. I don't use it as like a source of income per se. I use it versus donating things to Goodwill. The items have got to have a size tag and they've got to be in great condition or you automatically know they're gonna get rejected. Uh, now, if you have higher end items that do not have size tags, just a random tip, the real real will take items without size tags. They will do the measuring. So for today's video, I'm going to go through two of the partner kits that I've got. I'm going to quickly show you how to order a partner kit. In a nutshell, I think I've already said, but just to clarify, a partner kit typically remember I have a hack, is there is a list of companies that have partnered with ThreadUp, hence Partner Kit, and these are, these are companies like Gap, uh, Reformation, so some higher end, some mall brands, Crocs, Athleta, Vera Bradley, I think recently, and when you select those, you're going to get your payout instantly, meaning you send the box in, they decide what they want to sell, and bam, they decide how much you're gonna get, and they send you a gift card. And this happens very quickly. I'm talking within three weeks. I sent a box out for a Gap Partner Kit. Today is Friday, last Wednesday, and it, was in the, it got received and was started being processed yesterday. I got an email, so Thursday. That's crazy, right? So they pick it up at your front door. You can use any box. It does not have to be a thread up box, not a priority box. So just any plain old brown box that has, I mean, I use old Amazon boxes. I use old thread up boxes. I think recently I sent them a, like a food, you know, a food delivery box. It can't be over 30 pounds. The labels, you just print out the label at home and you schedule a pickup right through the thread up website. For me, it's always the very next day. They pick it off, off, off my porch. Within two weeks, I have an email with my payout. Now, I'm going to show you guys a screen share of how to get to these partner kits. Now, many of you probably already have a ThreadUp account. I have not been able to find a way to order these kits through when I'm logged in. I will show you how. Okay, so I'm just on a regular old Google and I'm typing in ThreadUp partner kit. That's what you type. And it's like resale as a service is what they call it. So you click on that. It's always for me the very first thing that pops up. Okay. Now it is linked to the thread up website. So why I can't find it from within there. I don't know. So this is just going through and telling you like, what is it? How do I do it? And all of that. So this is where things get cool. So you're going to scroll down. These are all of the people that they are currently partnered with. And I encourage you to look through them and actually click on them. So for me, if you watch my other videos, you know I chose Gap because I have three small children. I love Gap clothing for them. They hold their value in terms of the resale market. Like once upon a child, I get great payouts on. So that's what I have chosen. And I did so many that I got free Gap cash. I'm, in a, I'm getting a lot of free stuff from Gap because I got so much credit from them. So if you take the time to click on these and read them, many of them are giving you right now, this just kind of goes through what are your, you know, what the payout to be, blah, blah, blah. But if you read this, this is going to tell you, you're going to get a Gap gift card. It's only redeemable on Gap. 
and such. So uh, when you are ready for doing this, you just, how do I, you click on the link and you tell them that you're ready to order a label, okay? That's it. Now, uh, the cool thing right here is down here. This is what you need to look for. For a limited time, I mean, it's been limited since November, they're offering an extra 15%, which means a boost. So whatever ThreadUp decides to pay out, you get extra 15%, which can add up if you're getting a high payout. So I'm just gonna click order a label. I don't want to do that right now because I'm not ready to order another one, uh, but well, I will, I'll do it because I'm going to anyway. So just go through, it's letting you know the payout examples. And actually, if I click this, it's gonna show you my address, but you get the gist and then I print out the label immediately and stick it on a box. And then I go back in and select to um, schedule a pickup because sometimes I'm not ready for it to come tomorrow. Okay, so if you go back, you know, I just clicked this very first thing. How can I get a clean out clip? I clicked on that and that's where it told me the 15%. So we're gonna pause. I'm gonna go over my two most recent clean out kits just to quickly show you guys, I won't take forever, what payouts can be expected when you're doing one of these normal partner kits. It's not a lot, okay? I would not send in items that you really, so for me, I'm sending in all mostly items that I got from the thread up 200 pound bolt kits where my average cost of goods has been between $1.32 and $1.48. And so I'm, the, the risk is very low versus if they're not gonna take it at all. And I have found they take more items in my partner kits than they do when I send a normal kit. They're less picky, if you will. Okay, so remember, I'm going to share that hack still. So stand by. But yes, take the time to look through these, see who's offering the bonuses. All right. So these are my last two. You'll see right here, it says gap credit. These are found underneath my normal, um, partner or regular kits, they all show up in the same place. You don't like have a tab for partner kits. Like if I scroll down, I mean, I haven't done not a gap one in a while, but you'll see what's sold. I can't remember which ones I showed you, but I've done so many. We're just going to do my most recent two. This one was just processed earlier this month. And guys, I'm telling you within one week of sending it, they already start processing it within two to three days after that it's done. And you will get an email that says your kit is complete. And it, they offered me $41.62. I got my 15% boost, $47.86. And within, I would say, three to five business days after that, I got an email directly from Gap. Gap X Thread Up was the sender. And it was my, my gift card. So it, take, it doesn't take very long at all. Now, here is what you need to know about partner kits. You cannot change the pricing on any of these store partner kits, okay? Remember, I've got that hat coming. Oh, I can't wait to tell you. Okay, so for these, this is it. Like, you get what you get, you don't throw a fit, right? I've said that before. So I believe uh, they took 25 items. I believe I only sent like 30. So I'm getting pretty good at knowing what they're gonna take. And guys, you'll see. Okay, so here we go. This is not the band Proof. It's Poof, P-O-O-F, which is not a high-end brand at all. So I was shocked to see I got $4.45. This, these, um, I, they take kids items as well. So I know that these Cat and Jack jeans and this Nordstrom outfit came in a thread up kids rescue box where the bulk box. So I had 60 cents into those. So when you take the dollar and two cents I got for Cat and Jack, 25 cents for Nordstrom, it was a newborn size. Add those two together. I'm at least breaking even on items that my once upon a child did not want. Okay, this Morona long sleeve, um, this is that one, I believe that was new with tags. It was vintage, 63 cents, new directions, pants, 210. I mean, they, they paid out $2 and 85 cents on LuLaRoe dress. Like you can't give that stuff away these days. And they took the LuLaRoe shirt. They've always taken LuLaRoe that I send in, uh, these Primark sandals, uh, this Zaffold dress for sure. All of this stuff came in my thread up boxes. $2.85 on that dress. So, you know, I only had a dollar and 32 cents into it. I am happy to get that back and make a couple cents and then I'm gonna trade it, right, for, for Gap items. That Zara shirt was a personal item. This dress came in that thread up. These Catalina swimsuit bottoms also came in a thread up, $2.85. Wild Fable, Simply Vera, Jordash, Jimboree, no brand, no brand, Baby Gap, so, hey, this Gap Kids Coat, I showed you guys, Arlo, my dog is like dreaming. <laughs> uh, 
Um, that was one that I showed you for my own kids closet clean out and it was very faded. There was wear on the buttons. Come here. And my once upon a child denied it two times. I sent it in. It was so old and I made, come here, you can say hi, $9 and one cent on that. Aqua, Dex Flex. Look, say hello to the people. This is Arlo. All right then. Uh, so that was one kit. I just wanted to kind of list off some of the brands. So guys, this is like low end stuff that they're taking. I was very happy with $47. And let's see, I'll do this one. This was a great one. I got $79.73 plus my $11.96 boost. So $91.68, 31 items. Let's see. All of this came from that 200 pound bulk box that I recently had. I literally took it from that unboxing into a box and sent it in. So this joie, they called it a bodysuit. It was literally just a shirt. Here's the other thing with partner kits I might not have mentioned. Who cares if people return it? It does not affect your payout, which is the thing about ThreadUp that bothers me on normal kits is that they have, it's like you send an item in, it takes them five months to process it, it finally sells, and it's like they have a two-month time period before you ever get paid, provided that they don't return it, and then you get paid one item at a time, 32 cents, you know, because I'm sending in low-end stuff, so, oh, 88 cent email, like, I just got an email like that today, something that I sent sold, and it made me laugh, and which is what makes me love these kits even more, uh, let's see. Oh, I got my Gap e-gift card. I didn't open my last one and they sent me emails to let me know that it has not been viewed yet. So they wanna make sure that you got it. Yeah, I made 37 cents on, on a shirt <laughs> from a clean out kit. All right, so this Joao shirt, $6.69. Style Encore didn't want it, Play-Dohs didn't want it. I had a dollar and 48 cents into it. High five, I don't know, that was the weirdest little shirt. LuLaRoe. Sanctuary, Next, Florite, All in Motion, Ancline, Green Envelope, Simply Vera, A New Day, Jack's Girlfriend, that paid out $5.23. Quacker Factory, that was a free to me item. Some more LuLaRoe, uh, just A New Day. This Michael Kors dress was had some wash wear, still got $3.72. White House Black Market, $1.34. Uh, this was a, a cocktail dress from Amazon, $4.45, a new day. This J. Jill jacket just wasn't in the best shape, eight bucks, uh, $4.45. So as you see, the, we're not talking big money here, but for this junk, if you will, that like there's no way I would have taken the time myself to sell this stuff online, um, I was able to make $91. So those are the two that I just wanted to kind of show you. Process is super simple. Remember, you go over here. Type in thread up partner kit, choose who you want to order from, order a label, stick your stuff in a normal box, don't go over 30 pounds, schedule a pickup from within your account. You'll see my kits, click on my kits, schedule a pickup, they'll take it off your front door, or you can take it to the post office yourself if you'd rather do that. And within three weeks, you're going to have your money, and then it acts like a normal gift card. You can copy and paste it and do your online shopping. Now, here's the hack you've all been waiting for. Okay, so I already showed you guys. I have three. Now, we're, I'm, let me close out these two. I am back to, this is my kits that are active right now. I have three selling kits that are active, because when you do a normal partner kit, like the Gap ones, they're not ever active, because you don't get to edit the pricing, right? You, you literally your kit's done. It automatically goes from they received it to completed kits, okay? Now, um, down, ignore the first one really quickly. So these two are the ones that were processed on 119 and 127. These are the items I sent in five months ago. And it's your typical thing where you, you know, you click on the label and then you can adjust the pricing. It tells you how many days are left, but it's still, this is all stuff that I got in those 200 pound boxes last year. Now I have to give credit to my friend, Nicole over at Soul Inspired Seller. I was talking to her about the partner kits because she had gotten all those shoes in an order that she did. And she just kind of was looking for ways to get rid of some of the lower end stuff. And she was like, man, I just really wish, you know, some of these stores are great, but I would love to have a thread up credit. And I'm like, yeah, me too. Well, she wrote me a couple hours later because she's like my husband. They like to read the fine print. So like I told you guys to read through all of the different stores, 
she came across one that said, rent the runway clean out credit. Now I had seen that, I didn't click on it because I am not fancy, like I wear t-shirts, what's this say, let's go camping. You know, I dress up when I have to, I like to, but it's just special occasions. Anyway, I'm like, there's no reason I would ever need rent the runway credit. And I thought, why would I use that for reselling? Because anyway, here's the point. This is the hack, are you ready for it? Rent the runway, has partnered with Thread Up. You know, you get stuff in these DIY designer boxes and you can buy stuff that they have retired. They partnered with Thread Up and they offer a clean out credit, but the credit is for Thread Up. Do you hear what I'm saying? The credit is for Thread Up and access this right here. These two labels, you'll see there's nothing written. Oh, hi, ducks. These are normal kits that took five months to process. This was processed on June 27th, and I sent it in one week before. And here's the thing. Now, it's pros and cons, okay? They did not accept all of the items, and I didn't get an immediate payout. They accepted, let me show you. They accepted 21 items. Now, here's the difference. I'm going to get this money. I've already spent it. I bought a fun box yesterday. As these items sell off, it works the exact, literally the exact same way as a normal clean out, which I can't even order right now, but I can order these. And it goes into my little bank up here. I have zero dollars. It said, you know, it would say if I had credit as credit. Now I do get the obnoxious emails one at a time. Your item sold for 13 cents or whatever. And here's the bonus. I have access to change the pricing just like a normal kit. Where again, to reiterate, if you choose Gap or Crocs or any of those others, you do not get to choose the price that your item is sold for. They choose it, they pay you out, and then they do with it what they will. So that's a good and a bad, especially if you're sending in items that you care about the price, right? So maybe more high end than this junk that I'm sending in. So it tells me I've got 32 days left to sell. Now, the other bad thing is if this stuff doesn't sell, I make $0. So would you rather have guaranteed, I'm just using GAP as an example, credit, or take your chances on a normal kit where you can adjust the prey out and possibly, like, let's see, um, see one item already sold that I already got paid for, meaning the return window pass, Cherokee jeans. I made a whopping 30 cents, but, you know, is what it is, right? I told you, same crap. These three delivered, delivered. So this person has until March 3rd to decide to if they want to return this item or not, and then I'll get paid for it. I'm waiting an awful long time for my $2.16, but I know myself and I know I'm going to spend money on thread up. So if you're somebody who doesn't mind the wait like me and it's just going to get deposited and, you know, my fun box, I ordered two. One was totally free. I think I had $47 saved up. And the next one I got X amount of dollars off of. So, um, you know, take your chances. So this is the hack. Now, I don't know, like, don't be mad at me for sharing this. If you already knew this, and you're like, Thread Up's going to shut it down. I believe sharing is caring. And, you know, some people need some money right now. And maybe you want your money in the form of Thread Up credit. So that is the hack. So I am really excited that Nicole kind of discovered that and we kind of, we sent in our kits together uh, and they accepted a bunch of her items as well. Now I've ordered another kit since this and I did another gap just because I, I kind of like that instant payout, that instant gap gift card. And there are websites that you can use to sell your gift cards on that are totally legit, but they do keep about 20% as a fee. So, um, you know, my gift card, what, one was $90, which was great, but the rest of mine tend to be in that $50 range. Not really worth it for me to sell those. So take the time. I haven't looked through all of these to see who, but yeah, see Vera Bradley, Toad & Co, Rent the Runway. And see, you wouldn't know just by looking at this, but she actually clicked this and said, um, how long will it take? It says it can take up to three weeks. It doesn't. Um, let's see. If your item isn't returned within our 14 day time frame, your earnings will be issued for the item sold. And it, this is where she read once your earnings are available in your thread up account, you'll be able to cash out. We're like, what? Cash out? What do you mean? So when you click on this, it just says you can cash out. So your thread up credit, you can cash out as cash or credit. 
you can cash out directly to your PayPal account if you want. So you can get cash essentially instead of a gift card and just the same way. So yeah, super, super exciting. Now I'm going to stop screen sharing really quickly just because I don't want to have to edit this video and show my address, but I am going to order another one of these and just see if it allows me to. Hold on one second. Okay, I'm gonna, in the background, try to order one because I told you right before I started recording this, I tried to see if it would let me order a normal kit just so I was gonna show you guys how that process works. I can't even click it, it's grayed out and it says you can donate items instead. So I'm just curious if I'm able to order one of these Rent the Runways ones because it works the exact same way. So I'm gonna click through, order a label, Next. Okay. And so you can um, get your items returned also um, for $10.99 if they don't accept the items. I don't think I mentioned that. That does work out like the normals. I say no. Um, yeah, there's my address. Your shipping label is free. Get my label activated. So, yep. You can still order them. So let me know if you knew this hack. Let me know if you found this helpful. And let me know if you like seeing my payouts from these. It's not anything super exciting. It's not a lot of money, but I personally watch all of these because if people are videos I'm watching, if they're constantly saying thread up is taking Eddie Bauer or I don't know, like Van Houston, that's one that I feel like I see a lot <laughs> that I never pick up. But if thread ups buying it and I'm at the bins where I'm paying like nothing for items, I'll pick them up just to send it in and get credit or a gift card. So um, I enjoy watching these kind of videos just to hear. And, and the more you hear brands, that's how I learn brands to be on the lookout for and such. So thank you guys so much for watching and give, please give this video a thumbs up. If you have friends that are that like to sell on ThreadUp, please send this video to them. Um, leave me a comment down below and I will catch you in the next one. Bye guys.